All right, this is a short video at how to dual pair the Tribit Stormbox speakers. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. Now the speaker instructions that came with the device were not very, very accurate. And not only that, but the YouTube video that was posted either by the manufacturer, I'm not sure exactly who, Mine doesn't work that same way. It's the same, the device was the same, but for some reason the steps are different to how to dual pair these speakers. So hopefully this helps you. So I'm gonna turn this to the back side. I'm gonna bring my second one in here. Now make sure to start with your phone's Bluetooth off. I'm guessing it'll be the same for a computer, but I've only done this with my cell phone. So Bluetooth off on your cell phone. Um, I have a ribbon here so I know which one's speaker A, and this one will be speaker B without the, the ribbon. Another tip, whenever you connect, if you've previously connected your two Bluetooth speakers, you can label them, like rename them in the Bluetooth area. And that's also very important because you want to you want to know which one is Bluetooth or which one is speaker A and which one is speaker B when you go to actually connect them in your cell phone. So that's a good tip. Now, turn on speaker A first. And then turn on speaker B next. And this is where it gets a little different from the instructions. Quick, so this the, these buttons here are the Bluetooth buttons. Quick press uh, speaker A's Bluetooth and then quick press speaker B's Bluetooth. Now long press speaker A's Bluetooth. All right, and I don't know if you heard that noise, but that means that it's going to connect. And this, the flashing, means that it's trying to connect. So just kind of give it a moment to do its thing. Perfect. When blue, when the speaker B stops flashing, that means that they're connected. Now at this point, you're going to want to turn your Bluetooth back on on your cell phone. And then you're going to want to make sure that you connect only speaker A in your Bluetooth. Um, you don't want them both connected or else it won't work quite right. So just speaker A gets connected in your cell phone and you're all set. I would show you how to like how it sounds and stuff like that, but for some reason my my cell phone stops recording whenever I mess with my Bluetooth. So unfortunately, I can't uh, show you them both working in unison, or else my video will stop recording. But that is it. I have not had these very long, but so far I've been very happy with them, with the exception of the instructions on how to connect them. <laughs> We're not right, but their sound quality is is really, really beautiful. So, all right, hope this helps you.